heavy duty. We're not talking marketing slogans here. We're talking about serious equipment. Powerful, durable, strong. We're talking about trucks. Hardcore, hardworking, designed and built to meet the needs of a very demanding customer. A customer who has over the years made it quite clear they need strength, durability and power to get the job done. Which is precisely what we're bringing to the party. The 2001 Heavy Duty Sierra and Silverado will prove themselves the strongest, most powerful heavy duty pickups on the road. There is no doubt, these trucks are going to dominate the market. Of course by now you should already know all that, or at least be aware. If not, check out the appropriate web pages or refer to any number of resources. What you may not know is the critical role the transmission actually plays in making these trucks what they are. Without the Allison 1000 5-speed automatic transmission, much of the strength, power and durability of these trucks would never make it to the job site. While GM engineers realized they could pull tons of power and torque out of their engines, they also knew to ask, what good is all that power? if you can't get it to the road. Enter Allison. Allison has over 50 years of automatic transmission experience. They rule the medium and heavy duty automatic transmission market worldwide. In short, they are the best. Bearing that in mind, we'll point out these trucks are not for the faint of heart. Heavy duty means just that, and so it goes with the Allison 1000. Consequently, some operating characteristics designed in to provide confidence, security, durability and strength may be misconstrued by drivers not acclimated to the needs of the true heavy-duty pickup truck buyer. In other words, the driver stepping out of a DeVille, Impala, Bonneville or even a light-duty pickup and into an HD Silverado or Sierra may at first be a little surprised by the operation of this transmission. This potential was identified recently when a control group not familiar with needs and operating characteristics of heavy-duty equipment had the opportunity to drive these vehicles for a few days. The result? These drivers identified some differences in operation between the Allison 1000 and what they were used to, which is why you're watching this video. We want to make sure you have the information needed to ensure your customers know the difference between a concern and an advantage. For example, some people may notice a slight hum at idle. More apparent on gas engines, this hum is merely the sound of the internal oil pump doing its job. There are over 12 quarts of fluid to push around in there, so it's entirely possible the sound of that pump doing its job may get transferred outside the transmission. By the way, the sound effects you're hearing have been enhanced to help you identify them the fact is, in most cases, the actual sound is less apparent, especially in a vehicle with the windows closed. But under some circumstances, they may be noticeable. Other people identified a gear noise in first or second gear during coast down or part throttle operation. For example, when driving in city traffic. That's a good thing. Combine big, solid gears with a drivetrain capable of delivering over 500 foot-pounds of torque and you may hear the gears. It's the sound of strength. Some other drivers noticed a clunk when shifting from reverse to park. That clunk indicates the park pawl is engaged, a heavy-duty park pawl that contributes to this truck's best-in-class GCWR. Again, it's a good thing. It's the sound of strength. Occasionally, some drivers may notice what's best described as a startup clunk or click in park. That sound is simply the result of the transmission hydraulics preparing for initial operation. All automatic transmissions do it. In this case, it's the nature of the beast to be a little more noticeable. Why? Well, when you consider the robust nature of the components in this transmission, especially the larger, stronger clutches and drive components, it's logical there may be a slightly noticeable clunk or click at initialization. A few drivers noticed a ratcheting noise or feel occurring only when the transfer case is in four low and the driver shifts quickly from reverse to park. It can happen with any automatic transmission in a four-wheel drive setup. It just takes a moment for things to stop spinning 
and for components to get synchronized. Others noticed that when they parked their truck on a hill, they'd get a little noise or clunk when shifting out of park after startup. This is another one that can happen with any vehicle, and it's merely the result of the vehicle's weight coming off the park paw. It can happen with any automatic transmission. The last item we want to address here results from some of the Allison 1000's advanced technology. The Transmission Control Module, or TCM, uses data from a variety of different operating conditions to determine the vehicle's optimum shift points and shift feel. It takes into account everything from vehicle load to component wear, including throttle position, brake application, and more. The end result is optimized shifting forever. Of course, that also means there may be a slight difference in feel, including an occasional abnormal shift whenever the TCM encounters a new situation or pattern. But that particular shifting abnormality will rarely happen. That's because the system learns the condition and parameters that cause it and uses that data to optimize the shift next time around. And while we're on the subject of shift feel, keep in mind that one driver's upshift bump is another driver's positive shift feel. To that end, we did receive a couple of comments concerning harshness or bumps at the 2 to 1 downshift and or the 4 to 5 upshift. Like we said, it's simply positive shift feel and is actually designed in, helping ensure a firm shift with no excess slippage. Obviously, an advantage in any heavy-duty application. The fact is, the Allison 1000 is one solid transmission and its design, development, and production have been a joint effort between GM and Allison from the get-go. From hauling to towing and everything in between, this truck is built to work and play hard, real hard. And remember, for more information on either the heavy-duty Sierra or Silverado, including information on upcoming broadcasts, check out the appropriate web pages www.sierrahd.com and www.hdsilverado.com Thanks for watching.